Ahead of the government formation in Afghanistan, Chinese Foreign Minister Wang Yi said that he hopes that the new establishment will be open and inclusive and dissociate itself from terror groups. The Chinese minister made the remarks during a phone call on Friday with Iranian Foreign Minister Hossein Amir Abdullahin, Global Times reported. The statement on Afghanistan comes a few days after a senior Chinese leader informed the group that Beijing would maintain their embassy in Kabul. After the US exit from Afghanistan and the Taliban's takeover of the country, China is concerned about a possible revival of the East Turkestan Islamic movement, its cross-border agitation and terrorism in the Xinjiang region. The East Turkestan Islamic movement, also known as the Turkestan Islamic movement, is an ethnic Ugaihar group active in Afghanistan that has long sought to achieve independence for Xinjiang which it envisions as a future, East Turkestan. Previously, China had conveyed to the visiting Taliban delegation that the East Turkestan Islamic movement poses a direct threat to its national security and territorial integrity and combating the ETIM is a common responsibility for the international community. Chinese Foreign Minister had delivered this message to head of the Afghan Taliban Political Commission, Mullah Abdul Khani Baradar, during their meeting in Tianjin. We hope the Afghan Taliban will make a clean break with all terrorist organizations, including the ETIM and resolutely and effectively combat them to remove obstacles, play a positive role and create enabling conditions for security, stability, development and cooperation in the region, the Chinese readout had said. Meanwhile, the Taliban has stated that it will primarily rely on financing from China for an economic comeback in Afghanistan. Taliban spokesperson Zabihullah Mujahid said that the Taliban will fight for an economic comeback with the help of China. China is our most important partner and represents a fundamental and extraordinary opportunity for us because it is ready to invest and rebuild our country, the Taliban spokesperson was quoted as saying in the interview reported Al Jazeera. He said that new Silk Road, an infrastructure initiative with which China wants to increase its global influence by opening up trade routes, was held in high regard by the Taliban. There are rich copper mines in the country which, thanks to the Chinese, can be put back into operation and modernized. In addition, China is our path to markets all over the world. News Desk, Global.